Hey guys, welcome back to Triple Play Sports Picks. My name is Adrian. Go ahead and do me a favor, guys. Go ahead and subscribe to my channel and hit that like button. While here at Triple Play, we went with the record of 2-2 two and two for Sunday, October the 24th. So let's get to the recap. First play we had going was the Hornets and Nets going under the total of 234.5. And, and that one cashed in with these as the Hornets score 111 and the Nets only score 95. All right. Second pick we had going was a football versus Green Bay, and we had a teaser going on in that game. We had the Green Bay minus one and a half, and we picked the over 40 points for the total game. Fortunately, that one didn't cover as the final score was Washington football 10, Green Bay 24. So that one was a total of only 34 points. We just needed one touchdown. Third pick we had going was the Eagles versus Raiders, and we had picked the Raiders covering minus two and a half points. That one cashed in with ease as the Raiders beat the Eagles with the score of Raiders 33 and Eagles 22. All right. And the last pick we had going was uh, um, Colts and Niners. And we had picked the Niners to win by covering the spread of minus two and a half points. And unfortunately, the Colts ended up beating the Niners with the final score of 30 Colts, 18-40 ers All right. So, you know. Past week was a very, very rough week for us here at Triple Play. We can't win them all. We can't win every single day. The previous week was a winning week. And, you know, I feel like this week we should be able to bounce back. Let's hope for a bounce back week. And, you know, let's just see what we can find uh, to try to bounce back for this Monday, October the 25th. And, you know, before I get started with today's slate, uh, make sure you guys are, um, check out my Instagram profile at 3P Sports Picks. And it's with a Z at the end of sports and Z at the end of picks. All right, so let's get to Monday, October the 25th slate. Have a basketball game, hockey game, and a football game for you guys. First play I'm looking at is uh, Cavaliers and Nuggets. Basketball game, I'm looking at the total at 220, and uh, um, the spread is at uh, 10, which is pretty high for for this game. But I I just feel like with this one, I'm gonna do the total points as Denver Nuggets is a really strong defensive team with Joker, of course, in the both games they. Have, the Nuggets been playing. They've actually had the opponents scoring under 100 points each game. And, you know, one of the good teams that they actually faced the last time, the Nuggets, they it's the Suns, it's a pretty good scoring team. They've held them to 40 points in the second half. So, and, and Cavs, you know, they, they don't really score many points. So I feel like this one should be a under... 220 for the Cavs and Nuggets. So I'm going with that one. All right. Second pick I'm looking at is uh, LA Kings versus uh, St. Louis Blues. And the total for the, the total for this one is at five and a half. Blues is sitting at minus 185. But I really don't like doing the uh, that type of money line, 185. Almost laying down 200 just to win 100. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do the over five and a half. Because the Blues actually beat the Kings the other day. And they, it was like a total of like 10 goals. So I feel like this one's going to go over as well. So give me the over five and a half goals for this one. And now the last pick I'm looking at is a Monday Night Football game. And this one is a Saints versus the Seahawks. And the Seahawks are at home. And the Saints uh, did win the last couple road games. But I've always been a fan of the Seahawks playing at home as they do have a, a very loud crowd. They really, they tend to always play close games in, in, in Seattle. Now for the weather for this game, it is not looking good as it's a 57 degrees and there is rain gonna be going on with 20 miles per hour winds so 
On this one, I'm gonna do a teaser. And especially because Gino from the Seahawks, he's really not that bad. Uh, he has completed 67% of his completion passes. Winston, 60%. But, you know, I'm always rooting for a home team. And Seahawks is a, is a really good home team, in my opinion, all the time. They always tend to keep uh, the game close. So what I'm going to do on this one, I'm going to do a Seahawks teaser. And they're giving the Seahawks plus four points. Let's do a seven-point teaser for the Seahawks. So let's do Seahawks plus 11. And due to the weather conditions, I'm going to choose the under. It is at 41. So with the teaser, I'm going to do the under 48 and a half. So Seahawks plus 11, under 48 and a half. All right. So recap for today. Under 220 for the Cavs and Nuggets game. Over five and a half goals for the Kings and St. Louis Blue game. And the teaser for the Monday Night Football, Seahawks plus 11, under 48 and a half points. All right, so thank you guys for tuning in. Let's hope we have a bounce back week, a winning week. And, you know, don't forget to subscribe. I mean, uh, hit up my profile on Instagram and give me a follow, guys. And I, I, I always put my daily plays. Uh, sometimes there will be days where I won't be able to do uh, YouTube videos. So thanks, guys.